What's up everybody, it's Carl, aka Carl Drum Tech for Drumline Chops, and today we're gonna to teach you eight on a hand and the arounds you can do on the tenors. And I like to show these arounds to my beginning students because really these arounds show you the basics of quad drumming, like the, some of the basic arounds you're gonna run into. And it's just a really good introduction for getting around the drums, okay? So I'm gonna show you four arounds and I'm gonna show you the very first one in this video, okay? So also, uh, even though I teach these to my beginning students, even as they advance, we still end up using these uh, arounds as part of the routine for warm-ups and exercises and things like that because it's just, it just feels good to the hands and uh, it just gets, your, you know, gets you warmed up, ready to go, ready to play quads, okay? So here's the first first round I teach my students and I'm sure you guys are familiar with something like this okay so the first four counts you can play on drum one then the second four counts on drum two then on three then on four then on three then on two then on one and then Spock if you have it okay so it's basically gonna go like down and then up and then you're done okay so let's give it a shot So what you're doing is you're spending a lot of time on one drum, right? Like an entire four counts or eight eighth notes per drum. For a beginning quad player, this really teaches them like where the drums are. Like, okay, here's drum one, here's drum two, three, so on and so forth, right? It just teaches you like where the locations are in your hands, right? And in the, in the positioning you have to do with your hands in order to play the, this simple around. Now, as far as like moving your hands around, okay? Uh, there's two different ways to do it. One is to always keep your uh, hands on, or your sticks on one and two, and just, you know, at, just go as you need it. And then once you're done, go back to one and two. or you can kind of move ahead. Okay, so that is the first round I teach my beginning quad players uh, in terms of like how to play quads. So there it is.